All right, so Saturday, uh, I had Ryan over here, and he was teaching me a few chords and everything. Today is Monday, which means I had a one day to practice, and I think I practiced for about an hour. I, I don't want to spend too much time practicing because I don't want to get burned out, so I give myself at least an hour to practice. And uh, so Ryan showed me a few chords, and the chords were uh, the G chord. And if I can get the finger positions correct, so G chord. Oops, nope. Let me redo that. <laughs> there we go. G chord, then he did the C chord, and I remember my fingers were having a hard time remembering where to position itself, but today I feel a little more comfortable, my fingers aren't hurting as bad, I do got little grooves in my fingers and my nails look like crap but hey I'm not here for a beauty pageant and then there was the D chord which the D chord was something like this no that don't sound right that don't sound right. Let me see if I can find the finger position. Alright, so the D chord was ring finger on the B, third fret, and the index finger on the D second fret. D chord. D chord. D chord. And then the two chords that I already knew. E chord. said this was a G minor or G major I don't remember one day I'll learn them so those are the chords that I learned and as you can see today I'm having a easier time playing them And you know, I got to give Ryan credit, man. That don't sound right. I got to give Ryan credit because uh, it takes patience to teach somebody something like this. And he was real patient with me. You know, he might have been a little nervous, I don't know. But uh, I appreciate that patience. And it's only going to help me become a little bit better. So, <laughs> on the first video, I was trying to play this song by this musician, Otmar Liebert. The first opening chords of the song, or opening notes of the song. And... I was struggling with it the other day, and I'm still struggling with it, don't get me wrong, but I think I got a little bit better this time. So I'm gonna try to play it for you. Because it sounds a little like this. Let's try one more time.
So as you can see, I'm getting a little bit better, you know. Still don't know how to play anything, but I'm getting a little bit better. And then I, the first video I was showing, I was trying to show Ryan my little, my finger uh, exercises. So yet the other day it was like this. So I struggled with it, but today, after practicing for an hour the other day, I'm a little bit better. So I got a little bit better. Then I tried to add a little more something something to it to just see if I can get even better with it so I, I just went on ahead and did the same thing and I took it down all the strings as you can see it gets a little harder when you start adding the other strings but I think it'll just make me a little bit better as time progresses I, I, I gotta look at the video I gotta relook at the video because the finger exercise that Ryan showed me sounded a little bit like this it was like he said one two one two one one these I have something like that. I gotta relook at the video and figure it out. And then I was trying to show him that hey man, I was looking at this video and the guy taught showed me the uh the the notes to you really got me you really got me so i was trying to show him now the guy that, on the video he did it with one finger and that's that i'm not fast enough. i'm not fast enough for that yet so i actually have to use two fingers So if anybody knows that song, uh, sounds a little bit like that. And this is just me strumming the E and that G minor or G sharp or whatever. I promise you, I will learn the notes and what they what they are supposed to be exactly. So just be patient with me, please. So anyway, uh, my goal with the guitar is to just be really good at it to where I am connected to the guitar. No matter which guitar I pick up, whether it's an electric guitar, an acoustic guitar, a Spanish guitar, a blues guitar, I just want to be so in tune that everything that I do is going to be second nature so uh, right now uh, this acoustic guitar which technically belongs to my four-year-old son so I'm actually gonna to have to buy my own guitar so when I buy my own guitar that'll be the one that I really start practicing with but this is good for practice for right now and uh, as time goes by and as time progresses uh, you'll see that I've improved and uh, I promise I won't let you guys down and I won't let myself down because I really, really, really want to know how to play a, the guitar. Uh, and I want to be proficient at it. I don't want to just play it just to play it or say, oh, I can play the guitar. No, I want to be like, people be like, man, that dude can really play the guitar. You know, that's what I want, you know. And I don't want fame, I don't want fortune, I don't want anything like that. I just want to be able to play.
You know, I just want to, I want to add this to my list of things that I know how to do. And that's it. So, uh, feel free to comment on my video. Uh, I promise my videos will have better productions later on. Uh, and better pizzazz or whatever you want to call it. But uh, for right now, you know, this is only my second video. And this is what I got to give you until I start fooling around with the video editor tools and all that stuff. Uh, I promise the videos will get a little bit better. It won't be as boring as well. So have a good day. And I will just keep rocking on.